Taylor Liza, welcome to my channel and welcome back to my channel. So today's video I am so, so, so excited for. I have been wanting to make this video literally since I saw the first person do that, which I'm pretty sure the first person that I saw was Jessica Cobasi. Anyway, I didn't even say what I'm doing. Today's video is going to be the ugly location challenge video. I'm so excited. I love, love, love photography. And so this video is just like such a cool concept, like going to like ugly places and like trying to figure out like creative ways to make them pretty. Um, I feel like a lot of places have been done, but I tried to find some unique places and this was just like the most fun video to like shoot and film and like editing the pictures and everything. Um, so I can't wait to show you guys all the awesome photos that I got. So let's just jump right into this. Well, I don't have like a photographer or like a videographer or like a team that I work with. My team is pretty much me and my camera, but actually for this video, I had my little sister help me. She took a lot of the pictures and also was in a lot of the pictures and then I edited all of these photos and so that's my team my team is me my laptop and my camera and my little sister this time but yeah so the first place that we went was a playground um, I went to this playground I feel like that hasn't been done before a playground is a place that I feel like I wouldn't be like oh I'm gonna go like take photos at a playground but it's also like not I mean it's decently ugly depending upon your playground <laughs> Let's cut to the behind the scenes. So we are at our first location. This is a cute little park, not somewhere where I would like go to like shoot photos, but not so kind of like an ugly location. But I'm gonna try and get like a cool effect with like the light because the sun is setting right now. And let's see, so my outfit for this location is I have my little space buns going and then some like purple like space inspired makeup. I don't know, there's purple on the playground. I thought it might look cool with like cool lighting. Um, and then I'm just wearing this top that is from Urban Outfitters. I just wanted something like black. And then these shorts are from American Eagle. This doesn't really matter that much. I'm wearing my Vans, also doesn't matter that much. But yeah, this is our first location. So let's start shooting. finished shooting the photos here I think we got a couple cool ones it was kind of hard I couldn't really do like cool things with the lighting because the Sun went behind the trees like as we were getting here so hopefully I got some cool photos Final from the playground I got two this is four two photos that I'm like really obsessed with um, so the first one is this photo I'm gonna have the photos right here on the screen and I am obsessed 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 with this photo I was like I was laying on a slide um, and then I had like my sister like on top of me and I just like I like the like effect of like a blurry like thing So that's why my hand is like reaching towards the camera and I'm just really really obsessed with like The way everything like came out and the rainbow looks super awesome. I added that in editing That's how people get like those cool effects um, and I just love the way that this photo turned out. It's such a cool photo. And then I got a second photo this one I was like inside of like the slide or not a slide. I was inside of like um, like a tunnel thing and I was like, I just thought it would be cool because it's kind of like, uh, has like leading lines that like lead towards my face because it's like circular and so like kind of like, I don't know, I just thought it'd be cool. And then the rainbow also adds a really like cool effect and I feel like the rainbow on like the upper side just kind of looks like it's kind of like going with the curve, which I thought was so cool. Like I didn't even like do that purposely. And yeah, I just really love these photos. I feel like these were some good profile photos. So catch one of those being my profile on Instagram most likely. And then I actually have two more that are from the park. They're not really like of the park, but I'm still going to include them because they're super cool photos and I took them while I was there. Also, there was people like from my school, like 
playing like basket no not basketball Logan's gonna get so mad at me they were playing kickball they were on a basketball like court um and they were high key judging me but it's really whatever so this is the second photo that I have um and the third photo or the, the no the third and the fourth photo that I have these were like basically I went during golden hour because I was hoping to get some like golden hour like mm -hmm, some like cool lighting effects with like the different like surfaces on the playground but um the, the the sun kind of had already gone like behind the trees by the time we got there so the like but the sun was still setting and the sunset was really pretty so i like logan was like laying on the ground and she was like taking photos up at me and that's how i got these two photos i'm also like super obsessed with these and i feel like just with like my makeup like, I don't know, it just looks really pretty because I kind of had like a purple makeup going. For the second location, I wanted to go to a laundry mat. This has been done. Um, Aspen Olvard actually did that in her ugly location um, challenge video. Um, but they have like, whenever people use these in their videos, they have like cute laundry mats or laundry mats, whatever they're called. I do not have a cute laundry mat. We just had like our basic laundry mat that we went to. Um, the photos turned out cute or let's do the behind the scenes first before I get ahead of myself. So we made it to our second location. We are at a laundromat. You probably can't see it. It's behind me. Kind of nervous to be shooting here because hope like there's probably going to be people inside. But yeah, let's get started. My outfit for this location. First, I have these sunglasses. They are from Urban Outfitters. I actually, yeah, they're from Urban Outfitters. Then I am just wearing this top. It is from Penny's. I love it. It's like my favorite top. It says Malibu. I'm just wearing these super distressed denim jeans. They are from Abercrombie and & Fitch and then my Vans. And that is, oh wait, also I'm wearing these super cute little like star earrings that I love. And that is my outfit for this location. was a total success. I don't know how the photos turned out. I think some of them probably turned out well. We didn't get kicked out, which I was super worried about. There weren't that many people. That one was a total success. Now let's head to the next location. For this one, I have two photos and I actually have two photos for this one. So first I have this one of me just like sitting by like, are my lights looking weird? Is it focused? Camera, what are you doing? Okay. <laughs> We're good. So for this one, I'm just kind of like sitting by like the washers or dryers. I don't really know if those are washers. I think those are washers. I don't know. I don't know. I do laundry in the comfort of my own home. But, um, and so I'm just kind of like sitting there and Aspen Olvard actually had like a, um, a magazine in her video. And that's kind of like what inspired me to have like the magazine. And so I just thought that was cute. Cause like sitting there and like waiting for your laundry with your magazine, just, you know, chilling. And so the focus isn't on my face in this photo. Um, I think that was just an accident. Logan just didn't focus it on my face, but I actually kind of like, like the way it looks. And I kind of like made it grainy. Cause I feel like that goes with the vibe. Um, but yeah, it wasn't like, these aren't like my favorite photos and it wasn't like the cutest laundry mat but I feel like for what we were working with turned out pretty cute also I have this one of Logan and she is like sitting in one of like the laundry carts which I really really like that's like a very like popular like laundry mat type photo she's holding the magazine too she's got her cute little overalls we kind of had like a 90s like throwback like vibe going for a bunch of these photo shoots especially um the last one our third location was home depot um i have seen this one done again done once again um but i thought that maybe we could get some cool photos so we went to home depot here's the behind the scenes we're at our next location i am at home depot you can see it behind me, there's lots of cars. But my outfit for this location, I'm gonna do that first. So first I have these sunglasses. These are from Loft, I think, I think, I think. And then I have this shirt. This is from Urban Outfitters. I love this shirt, it's so cute. And then I have these pants. These are actually Logan's pants. These are also from Urban Outfitters. And then I'm just wearing my New Balance 311s. Oh, and I'm wearing rose gold star earrings from Forever 21.
go at like kind of the wrong time of day. It was like one o'clock whenever we went and it was just super sunny. The light was super, super direct. And I kind of wanted to like shoot like out in the um, like garden center part of the Home Depot. However, the lighting was kind of trash because it was like the middle of the day and the sun was like directly above us. But these are the two photos that I got. The first one is one of me. I'm just like sitting on like a little cart that was like under the thing. And then I like pulled out to sit on it, holding a little plant. It's not the cutest thing ever. I probably wouldn't normally like post something like this and it, you can kind of tell that like it's in Home Depot like it's not fooling you like the first ones you would have never guessed that was taken on a playground except maybe the second photo but like this is not fooling you this is obviously like a garden center yeah I tried but then the second one is one of Logan I don't really love this photo but I also don't hate it um she's kind of like in these plants this was actually plants inside and I'm pretty sure these were fake plants um but she's kind of like stuck in there however Whenever the photo is like not cropped, I'm not really sure how much I can crop it. Um, you can see like a little bit of the blue from like whatever was behind there, like whatever display was sitting behind there. Don't love these photos. They're not the worst thing ever, but not something I would like post on Instagram normally. Also, the people in Home Depot were hecka judgmental. Like the guy at the laundromat was so nice and he like didn't kick us out. But like the people at Home Depot, like we got some dirty looks. Maybe for my outfit, my outfit was kind of out there. But um, yeah, we got some really dirty looks at the Home Depot. The last place that we went to was Checkers. This one I had never seen anyone do before. I'd seen like McDonald's was a really popular one. And then just like a couple other fast food places. But I'd never seen Checkers done before. And I like low key kind of love a Checkers aesthetic, especially like right now I feel like it's very like on trend so go checkers they're having a moment even though I don't know I've never seen anyone shoot there before so I decided to go there obviously it's not like the cutest place ever but I thought it might be pretty cute for an ugly location challenge so we went to checkers we got some french fries and we were gonna get a milkshake but the milkshake machine was broken which is tragic Logan was really looking forward to her milkshake well, we are at our final location we are at checkers and my outfit for outfit for this location shoot is or my license is I have this bandana that's from Urban. I am wearing these big earrings that I love. They are from Forever 21. This shirt is thrifted. It says Giants. It's like a big T-shirt. And then I'm just wearing these really cool heels that are also thrifted. Let's go. So I'm having a bit of an issue. My photographer is eating all of my props. <laughs> I got like four photos. Nope, can't count. I definitely got five photos from Checkers. Let's see. So the first one was of Logan. She's kind of like biting into a fry and I really liked the background on this one except for the green bush, but that's okay. That's what cropping is for. Um, it just like, you can kind of see like the checkeredy in the background and like the little window that has like the Checkers logo in in the red and just like the checkered table. It just looks really cute and like with her outfit and everything, it just goes well. And then I have two of me like eating and drinking. Um, the first one's me just like drinking and like holding the little fries. And that's kind of has the same thing going on with like the same vibe. And then there's the one of me eating once again, kind of like the same vibe. It has like the checkers and the red and like the red kind of like pulls out the like orangey red on my um, shirt or dress. It's definitely a dress. Well, it's actually a shirt that I turned into a dress. And then the last two, um, we took like kind of like where the cars like are meant to drive through. This one had like two and I guess this one wasn't like in use so we just like took them there and I really liked the um, like top part. It just looked really cool. Also got a nice little like lens flare going. I didn't even have to add that in an editing. That was just like something that my camera did which I love. And Logan just looked so like cute the way that she posed there and so I loved those too. I think my favorite photos that I got were the, the two of Logan at Checkers, the like ones where she's standing, and then the two um, at the playground. Those were my favorite photos. Um, so that is all of the locations. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe down below because I do post new videos every weekend. Maybe having a couple extra videos go up and I'm going to start posting travel videos pretty soon. I'm actually leaving for my trip in a one week. I am excited.
ecstatic. But yeah, um, that's all that I have to say, so bye guys. This is my first time getting gas by myself, so. <laughs> Thanks. Let me have a little bit. But yeah, let's head, or, hmm, huh, English, woo.